all right guys for kage here and welcome back to the brand new video here we are solo level arise will be the topic uh on today's video i want to make the updated uh update video related to the shop i believe it's super important i just want to update you with the things that i buy now on daily basis and what for me are the most important things at the same time i will talk about the uh, artifact shop which will be gone really really soon and a lot of you ask me yo rokage uh, should we use our fragments while we can um so all of that i will cover leave a like subscribe join the discord server support me in content creator program we are on a road to 500 supporters plus i have still plenty of codes left please on this video if someone didn't get the code yet put your um id so i do it manually so uh the shop okay uh we have pay to win and free to play shop i can do a pay to win uh, shop by the end of the video for the people who are interested in that but mainly we're gonna talk about the exchange shop so we have celebration coin exchange like you already know the most important things to buy in this shop are the rate up draw tickets okay as soon as you can buy them as much as possible they're pretty rare in this game at the end of the day so get it of course i would say also that custom draw tickets are worth getting but if you have plenty of those maybe sometimes you can skip them and get something else but the rule overall says that you should buy the custom draw tickets as well guys uh i in my opinion well at least when you bought like limited tickets and maybe a few of those tickets or you just want to go all in and custom draw tickets as well there is also other materials that are worth getting in my opinion mana power extract currently now especially this is not worth buying because we have many other events which we managed to acquire those items so in my eyes don't buy this okay uh, related to other skill scroll 2 skill scroll 1 uh, mana power elixir 1 mana power elixir 2 and gem lucky chest literally whatever you need at some point get it in my opinion getting the gold from this isn't worth it at all uh related to the prices like getting scroll 3 as well is super expensive so literally the only thing what i would buy with uh red coins is the limited ticket that's all and then with blue coins i would play around and get overall what i need depending on the moment of my account what i need for my account currently to grow more definitely guys currently now since we're gonna get a revamp of the success rate of runes and blessing stones i would say that rune fragments are now a pretty high priority right here okay uh, let me now go to the weapon exchange of course you have two items the traces of dimensions and the mana power imbued casting this one you get from um, salvaging sr and ssr weapons and then the others you get from salvaging our weapons the highest priority that you need to buy is hunter exclusive weapon design still uh, much less rare than before but still extremely rare item in the game and as well overall i always prioritize melding cube selection chest from here um especially when i need it to limit break up weapon usually this type of material i i oftenly miss uh, and then of course whenever you need you can go for one mana power crystal selection chest for actually acquiring crafting a weapon so literally depending uh do you need it or not definitely skill scroll 2 it's not worth buying from here uh skill scroll 3 yes whenever you need it you can go for it but again prioritize hunter exclusive weapon design and then everything else literally if you need it go for it you know go for it but the highest priority is the melting cube selection chest hunter exclusive weapon design mono power crystal selection chest and as well even though it's not cheap since again we're gonna get the revamp and better su success rate you could go for some powder of blessing 
when you need it and for the armory okay uh, mana crystal exchange super important part guys in my opinion as you know and core mission keys and instant dungeons keys are a must buy and as well every day i buy melding cube selection chests because oftenly i miss those so that's why i go for that and as well advanced mana crystal is super important to have because in this way you can actually acquire a lot of artifact enhancement chips too in by crafting method okay in my opinion super important these are the most important materials to buy uh, of course when you need to uh, enhance your weapon you can also go for this you're gonna get pretty decent amount of material this one i believe overall we have enough in the game so i wouldn't prioritize that elixir one whatever honestly guys and this skill scroll one designs we have it in the game it's grindable and battlefield of chaos key you can go for it if you really think it's gonna be helpful i just don't go for that <laughs> i i just don't go for that I, I wait for improvements in battlefield of chaos overall and better rates for better gems here we are artifact material exchange shop a lot of you ask me should you spend your mana power in build fragments the answer is absolutely yes because the time left it clearly says says uh, says that in two days and 14 hours bye bye to mana power imbued fragments at least this is how i see it if i click on this i cannot read anything so in two days also the event will leave probably it will return or they will do just revamp they will revamp it but for sure in my eyes you should spend your uh, mana power imbued fragments if you can beat easy um if you can just like at least beat entrance and maybe demon castle 25th floor this is not worth buying because it's a gamble again if you really think you need one to actually do something with your account and progress faster then yes you can buy it i mean the the but have in mind it's a random stats so if you can beat workshop of brilliant light which we are getting a pretty decent amount of tickets you are good bro you don't need to buy those artifacts and what would i prioritize here rune fragments powder blessing the reason for it is again we're gonna get the better su uh, success rate of getting legendary better blessing stones and runes but at the end of the day i would say go for artifact enhancement chip too even though you won't get crazy amount but at the same time you will get something that will help you to uh, advance your artifact toward that level 20 so literally that's that make sure to use it use your material think what's the best for your account like this is super expensive not worth it overall right this is not worth it now when i see it even though we, we're getting a revamp it's super expensive um so yeah i still stand by this statement that this is the best to buy after artifacts which you mostly don't need um and then we have battlefield of time exchange uh here in my opinion again uh, getting the limited tickets super important getting the custom draw tickets whenever you need them super important but still the highest priority in this shop is the hunter exclusive weapon in my opinion because they are super rare material and you're gonna need them a lot to max out certain weapons and to craft them as much as possible everything else get it if you need it i wouldn't recommend literally anything else than limited tickets hunter exclusive weapon and custom draw tickets yes you could possibly go for the shadow traces but they're just like super expensive for a really low amount really low amount everything else you get as you grind the game so still in my opinion hunter exclusive weapon and limited tickets are the highest priority from this shop again it really depends on your account you have to play around and see what's the best for you so i don't want to command you what you should do but definitely i want that you know a few updated things related to the shop which is super important for your overall progression a lot of you ask me now the pay to win shop a lot of you ask me monthly bundles 
so daily growth support daily essence stones 100 worth buying because you're gonna progress much faster you're gonna get much more gold um you will have special sweeps your life will be easier and then on daily basis you're gonna get ticket and gem you're gonna acquire immediately daily essence stone so support as well worth it you get the box where i managed to get sometimes even the ssr weapon actually one time but as well you're gonna get essence stones coins um and of course uh gems here instantly you, you will grant that fifth day celebration uh literally you can go for it it is worth it uh, relay pack always worth it guys always if you want to buy relay packs which i still didn't buy this one but they stay oh they don't stay <laughs> so in two days and 14 hours i will probably i will go for this this is like 100 worth buying uh, this part is only like for whales whales i would say like some of them um this one i wouldn't recommend you could get like i would not recommend getting five with 500 essence stones the gold yeah whenever you need it as well this is low key okay and this one is worth it for 900 gems low key worth it that's still it really depends how your dolphin low spender it's not a must buy uh costumes if you want to have a costume and again you get the hunter exclusive weapon design and the free multi it's worth buying a uh, relay spec uh again all of relay specs are worth buying uh, level up a uh, little bit too whaley so it it really depends can you afford it this part is worth buying uh in the mission story literally all of this is worth buying uh a little bit at the end few packages maybe are oh, a little bit expensive like this one but you get a high value from this but still i would say uh expensive but you get a good things so you can go for it but definitely the lower tier packages were much better the same goes for the battle okay the same story challenges uh challenges are extremely good okay challenges you can especially job change achievement pack that is amazing this part was amazing this one now it's expensive you know but that tier one was since i bought it was pretty worth it uh when you have the subscription make sure to buy this and the limited tickets and literally from this everything is worth buying and it all depends do you need it uh, for the team uh, uh this is worth getting if you have the gems and again you can wait for the to for the team that you really want to have you know uh diamond you do you and that's pretty much it okay guys hope you did enjoy this video leave a like subscribe uh your opinions in the comment section below make sure to support me in content creator program and yeah see you next one bye